It was a youth meeting. In the crowd were many young boys and girls sitting. Very often during the meeting, a boy's eye and the girl's eye was meeting. Time passed by. After some time, they were exchanging jokes and spending times very close. A elderly woman called this young boy and she asked, Hey, you've come here for meeting. What are you doing? But even the following days, they were spending time together. The woman wanted to share something with the boy. She called him for a personal talk. She was very loving towards the boy. She always wished that the boy had great life in future. So she first asked him, how deep is your relationship? He said, she's only a friend. Elderly women asked, so do you think that she would be taking up a greater position than the friend? The boy said, yes, I'm giving her the preferences. The women said, oh, that's fine. But if you marry her, your life is gone. She said, the girl is very lazy. I know her personally. She doesn't even do her own work at home. Secondly, she doesn't even adjust. I remember one time her own roommate complaining that she does not want to switch off the AC though the other person in the room was feeling very cold. She just, you know, was more concerned about her own self. Thirdly, she's very disrespectful towards the seniors. Very lazy, not adjustable, disrespectful. If you marry her, you will have a very hard time. The boy went back to his room thinking on the thoughts what to do and he planned accordingly for the betterment of the future. Many times today young people meet each other. They don't even know the family background, the educational status, the dreams of each other but they blindly fall in love. Dear friends, whomever you meet today is going to be a mother, father, a brother-in-law, a son-in-law. Their responsibilities are going to be many. So before you accept a person to be above your friend, know detailed about them. Put them in the position if they really can handle the situation of your life and then choose. Do not choose blindly. Like how they choose in movies, they meet each other in the bus stop and they exchange love. They meet in the park, they exchange love. They meet in the class, they exchange love. We have to realize movies are script written. The end will always be good, but our lives, we have to write the script and the ends can change because always our expectations will not end like what we expect. So dear friends, remember very carefully before you choose your life partners.